Hi all folks, this is Max from Xenomax.com and Galaxy Tab 10.1 uh, or sorry, Galaxy Tab Hacks.com These sugars bugs are driving me crazy and making me upload some crazy videos on YouTube, my YouTube channel so please don't mind me if I sound a bit out of whack. Anyway, today we're going to learn to unroot our Galaxy Tab 10.1 A lot of you have been asking me um, they want to know how to unroot it, so just in case they can take it back to Best Buy or whatever um, to get their refund or whatever, replace it. Most likely, they're not going to even check for root, um, but there is a way to unroot it. It's actually part of the rooting process. Uh, we did flash the OTA 3.1 update, which has no um, super user and SU, which means it's a non rooted. Um, a non-rooted stock ROM and then we you know basically we can flash that back using a clockwork mod recovery and as for the uh, trace of having the recovery we can probably just erase clockwork mod recovery and then what happens is then you can actually root it really easily without going back to 3.0.1 like we did before but uh, when you take it back to the store there's no way they're gonna tell um, that it's been rooted unless they know how to root and they start rooting it um, but even then they can't really do anything to you anyway let's go unroot our Galaxy Tab 10.1 really quick um, so what we're gonna do is uh, go download the HC-3.1 underscore OTA dash full underscore SAM underscore tab underscore 10.1 dot zip that is the OTA update uh, file so what we're gonna do is uh, I'm gonna un unconnect this and copy that over into the root folder of your SD card. Oh, home button. And then go open up Clockwork ROM Manager. All right, and then we're gonna just install ROM from SD card. Uh -huh. And then we're gonna go find that file, the AC. This is the same file you copied over during rooting, so most of you probably have it if you rooted your uh, Galaxy Tab using my method on my site. And click there, and then just wipe everything. And make sure you back up your current ROM if you wanna go back to it just in case. Or if you're getting a new tablet, you can just copy the backup um, onto your hard drive, and then later when you get the new tablet, root it and then restore. So let me, I already backed up my ROM earlier. So I'm gonna wipe data cache and basically install um, the AC, the OTA 3.1. And then it, it, from a uh, user's perspective, they can't you know see it's rooted because it's not rooted. It's actually not rooted, but you can, it's rootable by, by just flashing the SU and rooting files. Anyway, after that, we'll try to get rid of the uh, clockwork mod recovery. Then there's like pretty much no way they can tell um, you've rooted your Galaxy Tab 10.1. So I'll be back when this completes. See y'all later. Hi, all folks. So I've rebooted, um, and now it's uh, OTA. I'm gonna skip everything for now. Um, I'm in the OTA 3.1 Honeycomb. No, I don't want to do this. Cancel. So I am on uh, OTA. As you can see, everything's stock apps. Just um, just doing this, you can't really tell it's uh, rooted. You know, well, it's not rooted. That's even super users uh, gone. But if you want to take it a step further, um, because you're just... Uh, I don't know, maybe you're just paranoid about um, returning your stuff or something. Then what you can do is go and erase uh, the clockwork mod recovery. Hi right, folks, next uh, what we're going to do is we're going to flash the stock retail recovery using Odin. So download tab unroot.zip file, uh, unzip it, and then let's put our tab into um, download Odin mode. So basically what you're going to do is hold um, hold down the volume uh, up, oh, volume down button and then hit the power button and it'll, whatever it stays in, it's going to re reset 
And just hold down the two buttons until it resets and then you get the logo and when you get these flashing things right after you let go both buttons like that All right then you're on downloading so hit the volume up button and now we're in Odin 3 download mode right now we're gonna go to our computer real quick here and when you unzip that tab on root file you get the Odin and the stock uh, MD5 file which will allow you to uh, flash the stock retail recovery so double click on Odin and then you should get something like COM4 there right and simply click on PDA uh, choose the stock retail and open and then just hit start and that should do it um, okay and that's done and my let's go back to the tablet and basically now I, it's gonna reboot but uh, we can check that the stock uh, recovery now the clock for recovery is gone by holding down the power button or sorry not the power it off uh, holding down the volume volume down button and then hold the power button together just wait until it resets keep holding you can power it off and do it like that too but I find this way easier on this tablet and then wait till and then let go and use the volume down button to choose the left one and then volume up button and now you should not get clockwork mod recovery so now you got the stock um, recovery so that's how you uh, unroot your galaxy tap and there's no way they can find out um, and then you can also uh, put the uh, there's a new clockwork mod recovery you can flash um, using Odin but anyway that's how you unroot your phone or sorry your tablet I know some of you guys were worried, but now you can get it to completely stock and no one can tell. Um, so, thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. And subscribe and check out epadhacks.net for more hacks. Um, thanks, y'all. Bye-bye.